Hello and welcome back to Ode New York. So, those of you who know, we recently moved to beautiful Italy and we had to take a trip down to Como to do family cohesion visa. And what does that involve? That involves making sure we have the right documentation and handing in the application and all of that jazz. If you're looking to do this, you want to do it through the Poste Italiana, the Italian Postal Service, where you can get the kit to fill out all the forms and then get the appointment date. So they'll give you a certificate and a receipt and everything that you need from there. Um, we've been doing this for a while. We applied last year, September, and now my husband had his first appointment in December. And then we had a second one in January for the rest of our documents. And basically you just have to go in and check up every month or every second month if you haven't received an SMS that your permit is ready. And that's what we did. And then we had to update our hospitality declaration with the new address. And um, so with that, we are now waiting, <laughs> waiting for the Vigili to come and check. The Vigili or the local police, they will come and check where my husband is staying and if he's residing where he said he is. And thereafter, we can get uh, what we need from them, uh, which would be his permit, his residency permit, which should hopefully be for up to at least two years, but it can be up to five years, depending on a number of factors. And uh, so we went ahead and did that. It was very exciting. It takes a long time. You wait in the queue for a very long time to hand in documents, even if you have an appointment. So book out the entire day if you are going to be doing this. Be patient. Systems are slow. So first thing you need is marriage certificate, proof of residence, hospitality declaration, maintenance declaration, proof of funds, family status certificates, a passport and ID for both parties, codice fiscale, Italian tax number, and a tourist visa if your spouse is outside of the EU. Once we did that, we stopped and had a lunch at this quaint little place, and then we went to go check out the lake in Como, because it was both of our first time there. So that's where we're at, checking out the lake, enjoying our lives, enjoying Italy, being happy to be here, and waiting for the Vigili, the local police, to come and check up on our, my husband so we can then get his permit. And just know that this is coming from the side of an Italian citizen. So I'm an Italian citizen, but if you are a permanent resident, you could likely go through very similar steps to get a permit for your spouse. If you want to know more, I'll leave a link down in the description where I write about the article. Oh, where I write about it in an, in an article. And if you have any questions, leave a comment or shoot me an email. I'm always happy to answer anything that you have. So fantastic. Uh, hope you enjoy the scenery of Como and go to check it out yourself one day. It is an amazing place, uh, especially when the sun is out like here. And yeah, so that's us. That's what we did. And as always, happy to have you here. Have a lovely time. Alla prossima!